Hello everyone, welcome to the first chapter of Ain or Ann. Ain, I think it's Ain of Fancy Star 3. So Reese is gonna marry Maya and he'll renounce his ties to his father and the Kingdom of London. And now he's going to be the monarch of the Lane Kingdom of Seal with his wife Maya, who is queen. And they give birth to a son called Anne who is the, the hero of second generation. So, uh, Seal, is, Seal and Shuzoran are invaded by um, a mysterious uh, robot force. They're invading the uh, neighboring Lang, uh, Lang kingdoms. So, and Seal and uh, Shuzoran are trying to survive, albeit barely. Because the, the cyborgs are stronger than their monster army. So yeah, not good for uh, Reese's son to be experienced this at 15. I know, I was afraid war will come again. Now you must venture forth on a vital quest. Legends of satellites say it is a place of peace. I think we'll need a sanctuary very soon. Take me a red and find the satellite. Hurry back, I don't know how much longer we have. So now we're going on a record mission, we're going to find information on this uh, legendary sanctuary called Satellite. Mm. Good thing about Anne, Ain, is that not only you can use swords and you can equip uh, armor like his father did, uh, he can use techniques because he's half laying. Uh, for his mother's side, he can use healing techniques and uh, I think he could also use uh, time techniques as well. But his healing techniques are the best, so I increase his uh, res and gi res up to their max levels. But I focus more on the gi res, anyways. So let's look around. Uh, we ain't gonna get attacked by monsters anymore because that was uh, 15 years ago. You know. I take it that the previous key is dead because we don't see Aid's grandfather in this uh, game. Well, in this uh, generation, so he must pass or passed on. So let's talk to a few locals here. Oh, tells only the chosen ones can dwell in satellite, eh? Ah, okay. Oh no! Armies of robots are surrounding the castle. Oh shit! So yeah, let's talk to our subjects here. Oh really? A place of peace, or so I hear. Ah, hello. It's, it's still alive in this generation. We're gonna be paying a visit to him soon. Let's see what's for sale here. Well. Uh, we got uh, items, well, we got armor from the last generation, so let's sell it for some cash. There we go, let's see all the steel staffs. Build up our cash. Bit of a nuisance, I know, but hey, I need the money. We've got to have money. Ah, uh, Miss Tony J. I loved his uh, voice acting. He was my favorite voice acting too. Okay, we're selling nearly all of the items now. Okay, we fill up our cash. Good thing that I've also got the laser needles for Anne, so I don't have to waste cash and buy new laser needles. I'm just being economical in this game, you know, you know how it is. Buy some dye bait. Oh, I think I got some dye bait already. Okay. Okay, this chapter is mostly going to be a plot relate, pl a lot of plot twists here and there. So, slightly boring this chapter, but you know, I need to, we need to find out what's going on anyway. Okay.
TLS really can raise uh, Ains technique techniques up. We're gonna raise his gear res because his techniques are great. So let's raise his gear res. Oh no, I just raised res and gear res for now. I raised River, but later on I thought nah, Gires is more important. So next chapter I raised Gires, but for, but I mistakenly raised Rev her River. So oh well. First, Mew second, and put A last because his HP is low at the moment. And he needs, uh, he, we need to grind on him. I don't like his HP one bit. Alright, let's, let's do our reconnaissance mission. Uh, we fight some new enemies now. Yeah, we fight robot types. That's all we're going to fight in this generation just machines. Sheets are slightly stronger than the enemies you fought in the last generation, but with the needles, if you use a lot of group weapon, group, you know, group attacks, that was really easy. Especially when you got a healer like a, a main character healer as well. So, okay, this is Shu Zorad. Fifteen years later, let's visit the king. Yeah, Lyle's king now. Is that his queen there? Oh, Lyle lost his eye. Oh, Fee, Tia. Or Fee. Oh so, yeah, Lyle looks different now. Uh, just minus the eye. He looks older. And he's got daughter now, by a, from an unknown mother. Who the member is, but we would never know. It's not important anyway. I take it that the member must have died from childbirth or something. King Lyle would never lead us to victory, never fear. Yeah, let's talk to the shoes on locals. Who was creating those brooded cyborgs? I don't know. Our fate is in your hands, Prince Aid. Let's talk to uh, the Iraqi King Dumago. Let's talk to the locals there. See if they know anything about the cyborgs. Because uh, cyborgs were originally Iraqi troops, so no one knows. Oh, okay, so they have nothing to do with it. I see. I wonder who is attacking your lands. I don't know. I thought you know because you're you're an Iraqi kingdom. Our people are not at war. Yours, Prince. We've been at peace for 15 years. So even the king does not know. That's not useful. Let's visit that uh, fishing village uh, his father saved 15 years ago. Let's go there. Let's see what they know. Take our boat. Metal silent music. Do, 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 do. And the metal silent music is dead. Okay, back to the fishing village. That's nice. They still honor my daddy for saving their asses 50 years ago. Yeah, alright. Okay, uh, I'll be back in a minute.
sorry about that folks, uh, my dinner was ready so I had to uh, postpone that uh, recording there but I'm back. I would just get some supplies here. I'm gonna get me some anecdotes. <coughs> so let's head back to uh, our homeland. Oh wait, what are we doing now? Oh yeah, that's what we need to do. So we gotta go back to our kingdom. Back to Sil. Okay, let's take the boat back. Oh, we gotta fight some people. Oh no, we gotta fight some enemies. Oh god. Alarm clock in the background. So yeah, these guys aren't too hard. It's just uh, mainly group attacks for a day. Should have no trouble with these guys. Just as easy as Generation 1. Alright, let's just heal up. Take the boat back. Right, let's head quickly. Head, let's head through Shuzora. I think Shuzora looks deserted. Oh Christ! Hope they're not dead. Well, we need to head pass through the castle anyway to get back to Seal. So let's do that. Oh shit! They're run by cyborgs. Shit, or machines, rather. Let's kill these fuckers. Oh, I'm bad. That's not good. <coughs> yeah, the enemies are easy to kill, though. Can't complain. Finally, somebody switched that fucking annoying alarm off. anywhere. Looks like everyone's gone. Oops. We can use grab. Swap like flies. E. Let's heal up. Bubbles. Or blinks. Well, that easy to kill though. Evil spiders. And he's dead. Yeah, let's get out. She's alright. Let's cross the sand bridge. Okay, back in sale. Okay, there's only one person there. Let's talk to him. One's well, gone to Iridia. Okay, well, before we head there, 
let's check for some chests that we have avoided in the first generation. Right, when you're take, go to uh, Seal Castle, there's a chest just, just close to the stairs to the castle. And shoot Zorad, which we are at now. There's, a, there's some Tribic chests around here. Uh, in the dungeons, there are no enemies, it's just in the cat. In the castle, there's like cyborgs, but in the dungeons, it's all quiet. So there's one of the tribates. Right, where's the other one? Okay, there should be a tribate chest around here. Uh, there we go. The reason why I collected these is to sell them, basically, get some cash. It's up to you if you want to collect tribates. You don't have to do this, but I just want to show you guys, anyway, what chests you missed. What chests I've, I've missed, rather, because I'm the one playing this, not you. What have I said? <laughs> so anyway, <coughs> yeah, we've got a long walk to the left. Looking for a long corridor. And now we need to head north. But yeah, they sell for 250 meters a piece, so collect them if you can and sell them. Right, we're back at the fishing village now, so let's just head to Iridia. Uh, what should we sell? Yeah, we'll sell the tribate. We'll sell the sword as well, we won't be needing that because we've got a laser needles, bitch. So those tribates. <laughs> oh, and uh, I only bought an escape pipe here. I or was it in the hashtag? Buy a couple of escape pipes. There's a reason for that, and I'll explain in the next chapter. But yeah, buy a couple of escape pipes. So now we're going to head through that secret passage, leading us to Iridia. So yeah, monsters are just machines, different monsters now, you know, just machines, we're dealing with machines. There are a few uh, machines that are new here, so I'll go, I'll introduce those, but most of them are, have already been fought, so I'm not going to reintroduce them again. Just a waste of time. So I'm going to avoid most battles. I believe, yeah, he's new. I haven't fought the guy probably yet. So let's take he on. Oh well. Well, I can kill him then. And AIDS Party 1. Cool. So yeah, I felt like doing this uh, cave again, uh, just to, you know, help people remember where to go. I just thought it'd be handy, you know, rather than skip this bit. We should be getting close to the exit soon. Okay, uh, we're in Iridia. Okay. Looks like a spider. Got spider robot sorts. I don't know what those two were left are. They're easy to kill. All of them are. They're all easy to kill. I need a challenge game. Give me a challenge. And they're dead.
Oh, that crazy style cyborg is still there. Let's see what she has to say. Uh, she's pretty much the same thing. So we'll be ignoring her then. And uh, we're back at Haztac. Has attack, sorry. It's been a while. Let's find some clues. Right here. Yeah, we already know that. Crazy cyborg. Oh, some more information. Satellite. Red's Cave. Could be. Let's inspect Red's Cave then. Okay, that's it for chapter one. Next up, we inspect Red's Cave again. It's been a while, but we need to go there.